Wherever she goes, she carries a fly with her. Because she found out the fly was her recently deceased boyfriend. Seeing that her girlfriend was in tears, the fly used her tears, he wrote on the table. He told her about his murder. Two days ago, he had just sent his girlfriend home. He was kidnapped and killed by his rival. When he woke up again, he realized that the whole world was bigger. He realized that he was reborn as a fly. The fly didn't want to die in vain. So he decided to take revenge on his rival. But he's just a fly now. A passerby cigarette but almost killed him. The outside world. It's too dangerous for it. He has to be careful of being swatted as a fly all the time. Just when it survived all the accidents along the way. He saw the rich merchant who killed him. The fly is very excited to see his enemy. The fly starts to get ready to fight. It rushes towards the rich merchant with all its might. But the rich merchant's cheeky face flicked it away. He's just a fly. And the rich merchant can swat him with a wave of his hand. The fly is furious. Since we can't do it the hard way. He had to use his wits. He kept flying to the rich merchant's ear and screaming. The tycoon was so anxious that he couldn't sleep. He had no choice but to wrap himself up in a mummy blanket. Then he could barely sleep. The rich merchant had no idea. This fly is here to take revenge on him. It crawled up to his face. Then it got into his ear. The rich businessman was itching. He kept shaking his body. And the steam box came loose. It almost killed him. The rich businessman is going crazy these days. He wanted to go out for a while. But the fly followed him. But the fly didn't stay in the car for long. So the businessman smoked the fly out of the car. That's bad. At the speed he was going. He couldn't catch up with the car. As he watched the police car approaching in the distance. The fly has a plan. It flew onto the roof of the police car and hitchhiked to the top of the police car. And flew back to the rich businessman's car. At the next moment. Before the other party could react. The fly flies straight to his eyeballs. The car spins out of control. Spinning three and one half weeks in the air. It landed firmly on the ground and crashed into the oncoming lorry. The rich businessman was almost killed. Then he saw clearly. A fly wrote a line on the dusty glass. I will kill you. After that. The rich businessman's whole life began to go out of control. He not only paid people to swat flies. He also paid a high price for dead flies. He always had insecticide in his hand to protect himself from the deadly flies. As soon as a small fly came near him. He keeps spraying and spraying. The fly doesn't dare to mess with him anymore. So he came to his girlfriend to identify himself. But when she learned the truth. She decided to help the fly to take revenge. She used her micro sculpting skills. She made a gas mask for the fly. Now he doesn't have to be afraid of insecticides anymore. Working out hard. He uses a toothpick as a barbell and lifts 500 reps a day. It uses a tape as a treadmill and must run 10k meters a day. He uses a wick as a stretching machine. Soon he has an 8 pack. The fly is confident that he will take revenge on the rich businessman. He lifted his cigarette butt and then rolled it onto the bed sheets. The businessman was almost burned to death. After surviving several attempts on his life, he decided to strengthen the windows and doors of his house. He hid in his house and never went out again. Everyone who came to see him, before entering the house, he has to disinfect his whole body. Now the fly is at a loss. He had to turn to his girlfriend. She came alone to the rich businessman's house when he's not looking. She quietly unscrewed the screws on the window and let the fly in. This time, it was equipped with Wolverine's claws. It crawled up the rich businessman's back and tickled him. He couldn't talk about love. He kicked the woman out. Angry. The rich merchant went to the local wizard. The sorcerer took a whiff. He knew that the rich merchant had planted the seeds of death. He said that the fly is the reincarnation of the man you killed and is here to claim your life. The rich merchant invited the master to his home to perform a ritual to get rid of the fly. At the same time, the two birds outside the window were injected with a magical power. Their claws became sharp. Their eyes glowed with a strange red light and hunt down the little fly. Though he's a fly now, but he still has the intelligence of a human being. He's more than capable of handling two dominated birds. The fly lures the other into the electric hole and electrocutes him alive and started the fire. The doors and windows were locked by the fireproofing system. The rich businessman watched as the fly collapsed on the glass outside the door. He thought he had succeeded in taking revenge. But what he didn't realize was that the rich businessman's cousin rushed in at the critical moment. He grabbed a sledgehammer and broke the tempered glass and saved the businessman from death. This is a 2012 Indian drama called Iga. Do well to watch it if you finds it interesting. Highly recommended.